Hi, I'm Dr. Alan Morgan. I'd like to talk to you briefly about what is IVF. IVF means in vitro fertilization. The word in vitro means in the laboratory, the egg and the sperm meet. Normally it means meets inside the body in the fallopian tube. Um, so that means we have to remove an egg or multiple eggs and fertilize them with the sperm in our lab, in the incubator. So the process goes pretty quickly. Um, once a woman gets her menstrual cycle, she starts fertility medications. Um, usually they're injectable medications that will cause the ovary to mature multiple eggs at w over about a 10 day period, as you can see in the uh, graph. Now, as the follicles, these are the little bubbles in the ovary get bigger and bigger, they make more and more estrogen. So every day that goes by, as the follicle gets larger, the estrogen level goes higher. And eventually these follicles might get to be the size of a small cherry tomato and it's filled with fluid and the egg is in there. We remove the eggs under a light anesthesia with a needle. All the eggs are removed in about five to 15 minutes, depends on the situation and then the number of eggs. Um, the partner will either bring a fresh semen sample in or we can use a frozen sample or a donated sample. We will fertilize the eggs the next day, our embryologist will check to make sure all the eggs fertilize. On the third day, she checks the embryos to see if they've divided into maybe six to eight cells by then. And then on the fifth day, they become what's called a blastocyst, as you can see in the chart. And the blastocyst is the stage we transfer the embryo back into the uterus through a small little tube through the cervix. That's called the embryo transfer. Now, we do have the option on the fifth day not to transfer the embryos, but to freeze them. Prior to freezing them, we could take a sample from each embryo, and that's called PGS, pre-genetic screening, through an, embryo, through an embryo biopsy. That little amount of cells that are removed from the embryo are then sent to a special lab, and they will tell us if the embryo is normal, and also we find out if it's a boy or a girl. So that's IVF. In a nutshell, thank you very much.